So if you're thinking about getting the previous generation M3 computers or M3 Pro, M3 Max, whatever that may be, versus M4, this may be something that might tip you over that I think the M4 generation may be better because of these technological improvement in the display that we may not know about. And the color gamut overall did increase on these display or the color gamut coverage, but they're just really just marginal. Okay, now with that out of the way, let's kind of have fun with this glossy versus matte display. So a couple things that I do want to show you right now is that I am going to close all these out and I have the same wallpaper showing on all of these. And the first thing that I want to do is point this towards my studio light. So you can see some of the reflection on the display and you're seeing that right now on these glossies. And by the way, between the M3 and the M4 generation glossy display, they're very similar. So what I'm going to do is just use two computers as a demo for this. Okay, so we're going to turn this towards the light. You can see how it's just really showing kind of the edge of light there. And I'll turn this one towards the light and angle this. And you can see how it's actually showing a little bit, but it's just more of kind of like just a light diffusion there. Now, if I do it for this panel, let's pull this out to the side a little bit. This is BenQ PD. 3225U. This will be your typical matted panel from other manufacturers. You can see how it's reflecting. And you may say that, oh, hey, you know, this is really reflecting a lot more of that white and it's blocking everything out. 